Hello Colas and welcome to Viva Barca. Welcome to the home of everything Barcelona where we are going to be discussing on the latest developing stories. We start with Memphis Depay as it has been reported that Manchester United have sent a January proposal to the Barcelona striker. We are going to be discussing on that as we move ahead. Secondly, talking about this report claiming that Barcelona are on course to match an incredible La Liga record this season. What is that record all about? We are also going to be looking at that. So guys, before we get right into it in much detail, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. In a major update, journalist Adrian Sanchez is reporting that Barcelona forward Memphis Depay already has a proposal from Manchester United over a possible move to Old Trafford in the January transfer window. The 28-year-old is out of favor at Barca and had come very close to leaving the club in the summer only to stay put following Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang's move to Chelsea. Having remained at Spotify Camp the Depay has played just three times this season for Barca, although it must be noted that he has been out injured since the last international break. Either way, the Dutchman is no longer a major part of Xavi's plans at Barcelona and the club are contemplating the possibility of offloading him in January. Recent reports indicated that the Depay himself had asked to leave the club in the winter transfer window, albeit on a free transfer, even though he still has six months left on his contract. And now, it has been claimed that Manchester United have already sent a proposal to Memphis Depay to resign him in the upcoming January transfer window. The Netherlands international is no stranger to the Red Devils. Having spent 18 months at Old Trafford between 2015 and 17, however, he had endured a difficult time at United, managing just seven goals in 53 matches. But the Premier League giants are in need of attacking reinforcements with Cristiano Ronaldo misfiring big time, and it seems like they are now considering bringing Memphis Depay back for a second stint at Old Trafford with a Dutch manager. Eric Den Haag at the helm of affairs, the Barcelona forward could consider a return to Manchester United. What seems clear is that Memphis Depay has no future at Barcelona any longer and he may even have played his last game for Barca as a January exit looks likelier by the day. Whether the Catalans are willing to give him a letter of freedom and allow him to leave as a free agent or demand a transfer fee for his departure remains to be seen, however. The future of Memphis Depay continues to be a hot topic of discussion, with the striker being mentioned in multiple reports lately, his future at Barcelona is very uncertain. Of course, he did pick up an injury on international break back in the month of September, and even though it has been a surprise for many people that up to now Memphis Depay has not been able to play any game, and to an extent where there are some in the Barca camp thinking that Memphis Depay is faking that injury just to stay fit for the World Cup, even though the player lambast and, this, and of course blasted such claims on his social media handles. Um, Memphis Depay, from the look of things, might leave Barca in January because it looks more of a possibility these days. Um, the player, when we consider the fact that Xavi has not, you know, been putting him in many games and he even before his um his his, his injury, Memphis Depay just played three games, just three games, just one hundred minutes of football. If you want to count every like all the minutes he played in La Liga, and that says it all. He knows very well that the manager does not have faith in him. The manager does not even see him as an important part of his plans and what is the essence for him stay definitely when Memphis Depay stayed in the summer because he was highly linked to an exit especially moving to Juventus but the move collapsed um, people were not happy for the fact that you, you people have sold Aubameyang 
And if Memphis is leaving, who wants to be the backup? Who wants to be the backup to Robert Lewandowski? That was a problem. So when Memphis Depay ended up staying, it was it was something to be happy about because at least there is a player who can also play a striking role and who can play second fiddle to Robert Lewandowski. But things did not even look as though you know he might. He, he look, in fact, things even got worse. So I think Memphis Depay himself would not be happy with the situation at Barca. And he will strongly be considering a move away from Barca. So Manchester United have been the most talked about club lately. You know, being linked to the player. Of course, he once played at United before, even though it was a very bad spell. It was a spell to forget. But normally, Memphis Depay now is a more better player than that season when he was at Old Trafford. So a move to United might be a, a strong possibility. As United, according to this report, have sent a general proposal to the players' agents. So let's see what happens after that. Then on to the next story of discussion. Real Madrid's 3-2 defeat at the hands of Rayo Vallecano did allow Barca to stretch the lead to go top of the table to 5 points, with the team telling 37 points after 14 games. Now, Madrid did play it yesterday. Of course, the one Cadiz two goes to one, so the point gap now is two points. With you know, two points gap with them right now, so we are heading into the World Cup as league toppers uh, with two points. So, following our comeback win over Osasuna, Barcelona are averaging two point six four points per game in the league. This means if the team continues at the same pace for the rest of the season they would finish a campaign with 100 points if the team somehow manages to do that it would be the only third instance in la liga history that a side would complete a century of points in a single season the first team to do that was real madrid back in the 2011-2012 season the under jose Mourinho. The Galacticos won 32 of the 38 league matches so to finish the league with 100 points with a goal difference of plus 89. Only a season later, that is in the 2012-2013 season, Barcelona matched that tally by winning exactly 32 games. The team scored 115 goals and considered just 40 to finish with a goal difference of plus 75 while completing the century of points. That season, Barcelona were undefeated at home, winning 18 of the 19 home league matches. The only team that managed to salvage a draw was Real Madrid. Interestingly enough, this season, Barcelona have won 6 of their 7 home league games so far. Rayo Vallecano are the only team to have drawn a game at Spotify Camp Nou this season. During Barcelona's Centurion season, Lionel Messi ended up being the top scorer with 46 goals and judging by the look of things, a certain Robert Lewandowski is looking set to finish at the top of the charts. The former Bayern Munich forward already has 13 goals in his name in 14 league matches, meaning that he is averaging a goal in almost every match this season. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, bye for now.